wonder what multi choice and big brother as a reality tv show take us the viewers for like they've seen us finish they know yes we are too enthusiastic about the show we really want to watch the show you know from the snippets of the reunion they've given us we really want to see what went down with chi chi fina and all the drama basically that's what they're using us to play tinko if you're a nigerian i'm sure you would know what tinko is is a very a childish game do you understand very childish game because i don't understand why after all the hype that we gave these people for free on all social media platforms they would give us a vlog of the housemates of the ex um level up housemates um trip to south africa cape town in south africa like i don't understand what's our business there like what exactly is our business now if you guys do not know pepsi took um the ex level up housemates to cape town south africa i think that was last year like all the um all the ex level up housemates really went for the trip you know that's where we saw the oh 100 million is too small it's chicken change it was beauty who said that and you know um fina was also throwing shades at the same table oh 100 um, 100 million are your mates this and that that's where we had all the drama we also had the drama from adekule saying um shex did not buy the azu bottle or azu drink rather that he was um posting or posing around with on social media you know all of that drama but i don't understand why i'm watching it instead of the reunion it's real it's a reunion for a reason so why are you showing me a trip that has long gone otilo why are you showing me the trip they had to cape town south africa was my business like was my stress they didn't stop at that too. they didn't stop at that disrespect they started showing us a recap of you know the moments of this housemate of this ex housemate in the house like we did not watch the show we literally watched the show we analyzed it for them free of charge on all social media platforms so why are you showing me the lovely see people are crying and sharing all their moments the um lovey dovey moments with shex and bella you know groovy and beauty groovy and fina ah, only um groovy had two girls anyways moving on you know the moments the housemates the ex-housemates literally have why am i still calling them housemates you know the lovely moments the sad moments the joyful moments and all of that why am i seeing that i don't understand i watched the show honey what's up what's happening i watched the show so why are you showing me all of that like i didn't watch it i feel like it was a total waste of time like no 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 that was a no no jigger they also you know asked them some questions about how they felt or what they felt about the other housemates or what they felt in general for example they asked them questions like who you um who they felt you know was more potential was the most pretentious housemates in the house and i noticed that they were giving diplomatic answers let me tell you how this thing goes in they're actually going to um interview them one by one individually and ask them questions like okay who do you feel was the most ratchet person in the house who do you feel was the most you know um pretentious person in the house who do you feel was the most uncouth person in the house and they are to give a freaking name that's how the game works jeans then now during the int the during the reunion ebuka will now shake tables with their replies he would ask the question and he would say okay fine we interviewed you and these were your replies he would play the clip and then he will now ask them the question in front of everybody but they will interview them individually you sure you see so for example if fina says um the most pretentious person in the house you know is bella ebuka is going to play the clip do you understand and he's going to ask fina why do you think bella was the most pretentious person in the house and when she gives her reason of course bella is not going to keep quiet now she's going to you know reply and that will bring out the buzz buzz we want you know we are not preachers of love for god's sake we are preachers of violence so we want violence so when the you know exchange of words happens that is the content we want so i noticed they were giving diplomatic answers this one would say oh i did not know them before the house i think it was doing that give that reply okay who do you think is the most, most pretentious person or who do you think was the most pretentious person in the house and though he was like oh i did not know them before the house so i can't really say madam but you lived with them for a very long time like more than a week so why won't you know do you get so i felt like you know they were acting so you know um safe so that during the reunion um they don't um drag them jigget like nobody tackles them and i feel that's very bad for we the viewers because we want all the juicy content what we did not see what was going on behind the scene 
we literally want every one of them but anyways moving on let's see some of the reactions from you know the bb9 jar viewers and how they felt towards the numerous adverts and unnecessary south african um vacation vlog of the ex bb9 jar level up housemates so this person tweeted these people no even pity those that are even streaming this thing eh imagine we said 20 minutes for pepsi vacationing guys i remember i stated that you know pepsi literally took this ex level up housemates you know on that vacation to cape town um in south africa now five minutes adverts i beg pity people data and petrol are big nigerian situation don't worst past all this like it's not even funny at all like why are you forcing down the south african vlog on us like which thing they happen which thing they share what's going on with you guys multi-choice big brother take your time this is an official warning from zini official take your time gay gay official warning from zini official don't leave me okay why are these people forcing their vlog down our throats exactly we don't want to watch with it consummate consummate i mean i saw all the clips i saw all the shades they literally threw at each other on social media like even when they were beside each other there was one for brian brian said because someone um was live and the person brought the camera i forgotten the person the person brought the camera to brian the person was also you know um an ex level up housemate brian literally has to go on twitter to tweet that oh please don't not everyone wants to see your fans on life literally and chumsy was like the person is close to you whoever the person was was also you know one of them she gets one of the ex level up and they were together so why don't you tell it was it was a lot more comments the people that directed and produced this reunion are mad people they will crumble for this nonsense <laughs> like do you know how, how expensive how exorbitant petrol and diesel is are you joking with me and you expect you want you i put up i put on my generator and switched on my data for this what's my business with your blog you they will crumble for this nonsense honey why are you all wasting my time watching this damn essay trip with this house it's like what what's my business what's my what's my stress what's my business what's my business it was so infuriating. I kept I kept on watching because I thought at some point they would just switch on to the reunion and you know would have some content and I will feed you guys on some content. But um, more nothing, nothing, no multi choice. Which kind of rubbish is this? Please help me ask them. Maybe when we drag them, like I better ask my neighbor, they would get some sense. They will use their reasoning faculty, which I'm very sure is faulty. Because what's this? Is it not a reunion? You people said we should watch on from starting from the first, um, 19th of June by 10 p.m. I'm supposed to be sleeping by now, but I decided to stay up so I can even, you know, make the content out of it for you guys and, you know, upload before I go to bed. And I'm watching a save vlog. What's my be? What's my, what's my concern? Kilo Shelley. Kilo she Multi choice. Multi choice. Take your time. You literally need to take your time. You people are doing too much because you see that ah, uh, we found the people a lot. We found the brother. We like the brother. You're not doing any hour B. Was this episode necessary though? Ask, help me ask them. Was it cool? necessary? It wasn't necessary at all. Like we didn't even need to know. What, they didn't even give us any spice. So it was just little clips here and there. You know, and here and there of them folding their clothes and everything. Like, I don't understand. They even ask them, okay, um, the people you're very close to, the people you talk to now that the show is over. I even heard Groovy mention Fina as, you know, one of the people he he was still cool with during that trip. And, you know, in my head, I was like, really? Then I remember that during the um, Pepsi um, trip or vacation, rather, to Essie, they were literally cool with each other. So it wasn't really a problem at that time. You know between the both of them guys like just share your thought with me in the comment section about how you feel about today today is literally meant to be the first day i mean we should have watched today's episode and you know be anticipating it even a lot more what the hell they just point the whole suspense and you know the enthusiasm to watch the show but you know dying the whole fans of big brother ninja we'll still watch tomorrow so i'm sure tomorrow they are gonna like commence the major content that is the reunion which should have started today so you guys should just keep your fingers crossed and your legs crossed 
tomorrow by 10 p.m on the same channels wherever it is you watched all of the nonsense they showed us it's still gonna air on those same you know channels make sure you watch them as well don't forget so thank you guys so much for watching and listening please subscribe to my channel give this video a thumbs up guys and turn on your post notification to be alerted asap when i post a new video it's your girl zini and i'm here and i'm gonna continue being here as long as it's big brother as long as it's any reality tv show as long as it's just honey as long as it's entertainment i am your plug see you all in my next video with undiluted gist bye